Shalom Akim for us all praise and glory to you. How well Bahashim Yavashat Bahashim Rakhakwadash, the modern boss millstone, and such and select. Come back another quick lesson, real quick. Based on that, if you're hearing the truth right now, bro, you know, there's time for you, man. If you're hearing the truth before, wait till the, before the phantom word comes, bro, you have time to get right, man. You know, if, this is the, basically time for you to take control of your own life, basically, bro. At the end of the day, you don't really have the control, but. It's like you say, if you have, if you're hearing this word, if you hear it, bro, and most high allows it, you get this truth. Hey, get it, bro. You know, it's up to most, most times that taking that first step to even get it, man. You know, like hey, once you learn, once you learn, bro. Hey, and most most of the time, just thinking this, he's got to go with the blows. That's it. But once you, but hey, if you're hearing it, if you're hearing the word, you're like it's it's connecting to you, man. You know, get you know, get with it, bro. Get with it before it's too late. Because there's people out there, there's a lot, a lot of people out, honestly, a lot of people are, there is procrastinators. They'll hear the word, they'll, they'll in fact, it's anything. You know, they'll do this, like, you know what, I'll do that next week. And next week comes around, they try a little bit, and they don't really try. You know, they just kind of like, they just kind of half-ass it, bro. So that's a big thing, that's honestly a big thing in the world, they kind of kind of cut off as being, pro, as procrastinating, basically. So if you hear this truth, you hear this word, man, you know, get it, bro. Get this truth. Get this word, man. Before it's too late. Before, you know, I'm going to get that first in, Pro first in Proverbs real quick. You don't want to end up like this, bro. This is Proverbs 1 or verse 23, and it reads, Turn you and your proof. Behold, I will pour my spirit unto you. I'll make my word, my words, I'll make, sorry, I will make known my words unto you. Because I have called, and you refuse, I have stretched out my hand, and no man regardeth. He has set not set at not all my counsel, and when none may approve, I will also laugh at your calamity. I will mock when you fear cometh. You know why I'm also mock, man? Because hey, he gave you that opportunity. He gave you that time of redemption. When your fear comes at desolation, when destruction comes as a whirlwind, when distress and anguish come upon you, then shall they call upon me. But I will not answer. They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. For they hated knowledge and not and did not choose the fear of the Most High. So you don't want to end like that, bro. You know, like when it's too late, you know, like oh shit, it's already too late. I fucked up. Try to seek the Most High and it's nowhere to be found, bro. That one video, like oh I had in my my watch history, but it's gone now. Now you can't find it. For, now you can't find the. Now you can't find the truth anymore. You don't want to end up like that, bro. It's a as right now, it's like it might be time. Like, well, my guys, my has some luxury time, bro. My some time to yourself. You just put the video, you know, just get into it for like a little bit, man. That's all I do. As long as that first step, bro. That first step is very important, basically. That shows that hey, you got intentions to do this truth. And a lot of people they won't take that first step, man. They won't take that initiative. That's that's basically the thing about taking initiative. Because you know what, any motherfucker can say, like, this, even in a worldly sense, any motherfucker can say, yeah, I'm going to go go to the gym tomorrow. I'm going to go to the gym, this and that, bro. And when tomorrow comes, like, ah, you know what, this happened, that happened, I don't feel like really going at that right now. And as long as you take that first step, and, hey, and I know I happened to me, you know, I knew before, you know, I said, I'll, I'll do this, then it didn't happen, bro. When, like, when I used to go to the gym, right, like, when I used to go, like, on, like somewhat, on a regular basis, bro. It was easier to do to do it while I was already doing it. Basically, that first day you do it, the next day you come back, you do it. The third day, and it comes like a little bit of a habit, basically. As long as that first step that people do not want to take, people do not want to take initiative in their own lives. People just want to just just basically let things happen to them, and they won't do anything about it. Gotta take, you know, that could, like, you know, like even talking to a woman, bro. You know, like not all bitches are gonna fall upon your lap. You gotta go, you gotta go seek them out. You know, one, you know, come I say no, but hey, there's gonna be some that say yes, man. So hey, it's just taking initiative in your life, bro. It's it's basically you take you take there's a little bit of control that you have, bro, and you take it, man. You know, it ain't that hard. It ain't that hard to start a hobby, bro. It ain't that hard to just learn something new. It's just taking that first step. And this is the truth, man. That's the most important part. If you're hearing this, bro, if you're hearing it before, before you're know, the up word, man, before you, when you got this time, you know, when things are going all right for yourself, 
Well, things aren't going too bad, bro. You know, take this, man. Take this truth. That's the best thing for you to do for your life. And what you got to lose, bro? What you got to lose? But you look, if you're not doing this truth, then what the fuck are you doing, man? Honestly, what are you doing? This is Isaiah 55, verse 6. May seek ye, seek ye the most high while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. And right now, he the most high near, man. Most high sent all his prophets and two prophets out saying that, hey, bold instruction is coming. Get right before it happens. The wicked forsake his way <clears throat> and the unrighteous man his thoughts. And let him return unto the most high and he will have mercy upon him. If you have, if you return to Mosai, Mosai, have mercy upon you, bro. And to our power, for he'll abundantly pardon. Abundantly. So, hey, take that. You know, take it, bro. This truth is near, bro. Truth is near. Truth is ready. You're Mosai only calling forever. He's not, man. So take it while you can. You never know. Shit, tomorrow you could, tomorrow you could possibly die. It's a possibility, bro. More possible. I might, I mean, might die also, man. Yeah, I could be driving. I could be even walking outside. Or I could be something, bro. I could take out the trash and some dude just ain't paying attention, bro. Fucking, fucking ran me over. Yeah, that's the truth. It could, anything could happen at any moment. So get right where you can. Now, this is Psalms 105, verse 18. Sorry, okay. And it reads, The Most High is nigh unto all of them that call upon him, and to all that call upon him in truth. <laughs> he will fulfill the desire of them that fear him. He will also hear their cry and will save them. He, the Most High, preserves all of them that love him, but all the wicked will he destroy. See, do you love the Most High or you? Or you hate, or you're wicked, bro. No in between. You're with Most High or against it. So hey, so you want to be in, you want to be in that right path, man. So hey, all the, at the end of the day, people know that this place is gonna be destroyed. This people know that this is this is the wicked society, man. People know that hey, this place won't got ain't, ain't really got that long. You know, oh, uh, judgment is coming, and this and that, man. But they don't they don't really care. They're more like, oh well, I'll get to that when when time comes closer, man. But we don't know when time get closer. You know, think that do, those dudes in the twin tower, do you think that they're they they knew that they're gonna um, they were gonna die that day, bro? They didn't. They like was well, well, another day. If I have plans to go out to out to work. Probably motherfuckers had a reservation for that day, as like or the next day. Like yeah, I'm gonna go do this or yeah, bro, I have a I'm on vacation next week actually. Like no, they didn't know. They that they fucking they most I at the end of most I most I made made him perish that day. So hey, get the truth while you still can. While it's while it's near, bro. Why he get it, man? Get it. Yeah, place y'all gotta be stop that procrastination. Me myself too, and I got some procrastinating thing too, man. But that's the big thing, bro. It's to gotta stop procrastination. That will basically stop a lot of people, man. People don't want to take initiative. People just want to wait. Like, oh, I'll wait for it later, man. I'll wait to do that later. Well, I'll wait to do that. Oh, I'll do it later. I'll do it later. Later never comes. Later is always later. Ezekiel 18 and verse 21. And it reads, But if the wicked will turn from all his sins that he had committed and keep all my statutes and do that which is lawful and right, he shall surely live he shall not die. All his transgressions that he have committed, they shall not be mentioned unto him. And his righteousness that he have done, he shall live. So, hey, you're like, oh, I, you know, I've been, i gone, I'm too far away into the world, bro. It's like, listen, bro, let me read this again. All, your, all his transgressions that he have committed, they shall not be mentioned unto him. Basically, hey, if you get to the truth, man, hey, Whoever you were before, you you could have wicked ass motherfucker, dude. You could you could done some wicked ass shit, bro. But if you come back to Mosai, hey, that doesn't apply to you no more. All that all that's worrying now, 
is from here on out. It doesn't matter who you were before, no matter the man you used to be, it was the man as you are now and who you're going to be. That's basically what it is. You know, so hey, don't worry about it, man. Don't worry about who. Oh, uh, well, I'm too far wrong, man. I've done too much shit. You know, I don't think no salvation. I mean, yes, there is. Just, you just, you're just trying to find excuses, basically, to not do this, bro. You take charge of your life, man. That's the one. They just want to keep doing what they're doing. Like, well, uh, you know, you're probably right, but it's just, like, no, bro. Do this thing and get right. Let me read this real quick. This revelation this is like an Acts 3 and verse 19. And we should repent ye therefore keep and be converted that your sin may blot that your sin may be blot out when the time of refreshing shall come the pens of the Most High. And he shall send Yahashim Mashiach, which is preach preach I say which before which preach unto you, Salakia, whom the heavens must receive unto the time of restitution of all things. But Yahweh have spoken by the, the mouth of his holy prophets since the world began. So, hey, get you know, get get right. You know, get to this truth. You know, make make yourself right, bro. Try to find this truth before that happens. Because when that happens, it's too late. It's too late for you already. You know, so hey, don't don't procrastinate in this truth, bro. Don't procrastinate because that's all. That's all. Honestly, it doesn't affect anyone else. That affects you and your salvation. The only person it affects is you, man. You know why? You're not helping yourself, bro. Why won't you help? You know, help yourself, man. Help yourself to achieve salvation. That's the best thing you can say. Yeah, help, help yourself. You know, look, every, every man got to seek out their own salvation, bro. You know, I, I, it, doesn't, it doesn't affect me, but it affects you. So, hey, you know, hey, that's, that's the best thing to say. It doesn't affect me. It affects you. So, hey, get right, man. Get right. Because, hey, as regardless, but I'm, every man is trying to seek their own salvation, bro. If you're not seeking yours, hey, that's, that's on you, man. You can't, no one can, no one's at fault because you fucked up, basically. And, hey, people are preaching, people are preaching to people are saying, hey, get right, get right, get right, bro. It ain't taking it, man. Hey, you ain't taking it, man. I was like, well, maybe if I can use the right words, maybe, oh, maybe if I say it more smoothly, maybe I can pull out this precept, maybe I can pull out that precept. No, bro. You heard the word, you heard the truth, you still didn't take heed to it. Hey, that's up with you the most high, bro. Honestly, that's what I'm gonna get, bro. That give all, that give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashin, Yahweh, Shai, Bahashin, Hakodash, Nesakin, Shalom.